Yes, Santa, I know I've been bad, but I need your help. It's that beaver again. He's back in my house, and he got a buddy from Australia, and I got all my Christmas tree cakes. Let me call you back. This won't stand. Those are mine. So why don't you take your little buddy and eggnog on out of here? Jeez. Hey everyone, I'm out here in Hermitage, Pennsylvania. I'm at Crane Axe. You know how much I love this place. If you've seen my Christmas videos here from the past, and even a couple of Easter ones here, you know how awesome this place is and just how much fun it is to be here and look at everything and check out Santa's Wonderland in here. It's awesome. The people that work here put so much time and work into making it special and unique. Every single year it looks different, and I'm excited to bring you guys along with me. I know it's early November, but if you can believe it or not, Santa's Wonderland has been open since September. Yeah, that's how many people they get here from around the world to check this place out. And we're here in early November to beat the line because normally when I've been here in the past, there's a line of people going all the way down the sidewalk here. So this is awesome. What are we waiting for? Let's go in there and check it out for 2023. Okay, let's go check it out. Let's see what they got here. Ooh. It's Santa's Christmas land. Let's go. And then we'll go around the store like we normally do. Oh, we gotta push the door. Awesome. Wow, look at that. Where you can get your photo here. That's so cool. I like that. It's just a shame that I'm by myself. <laughs> Kate is in Australia, and well, Kate, I can't wait to bring you here. Anyway. We walk down this way like we normally do. We got a few people here. Dear Santa, I want a new puppy for Christmas. That's awesome. And that's right on this beautiful display that they set up here right at the entrance to Santa's Christmas land. Believe in the magic of Christmas. Oh, I'm excited. Let's get ready to go in here and see what they got. Wow. Look at the gingerbread cookie trees. Gingerbread men. Look at the hearts. Look at that, that's adorable. <laughs> I love that so much. Everybody's so happy here. This is really awesome. And don't mind me talking so much, I'm just trying to do so I don't get a copyright claim with the music, but it's awesome in here, I'll say that. It's beautiful, that, that's adorable. On the other side they have gingerbread houses too. It even smells like gingerbread in here. It smells like gingerbread in here. That's wild. <laughs> and cinnamon. Yeah, look, the, the cinnamon ornament on the tree. And then look over here. They got happy dancing stars. That is the most adorable thing I've ever seen. <laughs> and I just love it because they make it different every year. Every year they make this completely different. As I mentioned in the intro, the people that work here, they put so many countless hours into building this and making it look like this. They work on it basically all summer long. And I mean, just look at the work. Job well done. And we're just getting started. And actually, look, we got a pretty decent amount of people here. Making s'more memories. I love that. Look at these lights on the tree too. I don't know if you can see that, how they look like they're actual flames. Like actual candles? That's really cool. That one back there, that thing's having a rave. <laughs> look at look at the uh, marshmallows, the s'mores. They're fishing. There's one swimming. <laughs> I love it with the marshmallows. There's the crazy cat lady. Look at that. Isn't that cool? <laughs> I love the amount of work that they put into this. There's the Harley boy there. I love this. This is awesome. Oh, there's my Christmas tree back there with all the ornaments of snacks. Look at that. Hot dogs. I see Heinz ketchup. <laughs> Popcorn. Then there's the candy tree right here with the Reese's and the Hershey's. Awesome. 
And then over here, oh, I almost forgot the Coca-Cola tree. Wow. This is incredible. Look at the raccoon over there playing with the lights. <laughs> the reindeer here. There's a fox back there. He's just hiding. Look at the amount of trees, though. They always have so many Christmas trees. Oh, look at the look at that, the little raccoon ornament. That's adorable, too. I love that. They got hedgehogs. Wow. And they have a stocking with Nate's sweater on there. There, I did another one and all the other ornaments with it. Look at the lantern lights. I, I gotta say, I really like those a lot. They look like That's awesome. <laughs> look at that deer over there just nodding her head, just loving life. Oh! I'm getting one of these. I can't touch it on the display. They don't want you touching the display, see? But I will guarantee you that they have these available for sale in their store because they always just have so many things. So we're going to find a snowy owl to put on my Christmas tree. That's my favorite stuff. That's my favorite owl of all kinds. I love snowy owls. That's awesome. Here's Mrs. Claus kitchen here. Look at this. Look at that with all the elves. Let, well, let me get my mug off of camera so you can actually see it. This is incredible. Look at the penguins hanging in the freezer there. They're sliding out of the freezer. I love it. <laughs> hey, you guys did really great beating the San Jose Sharks last night 10 to 2. What a heck of a hockey game that was. What a blowout. Hi, Mrs. Claus. Look at all her helpers here in the kitchen. My goodness. I can't even imagine how much time it took to build this. This is in, this is incredible. I wish I had a kitchen this nice and this large with a desk like this to cook on and everybody could sit. Look at the dog. <laughs> Oh boy, I wish I wish people could be here for this. I wish Nate and Marion could be here. I wish Kate could be here. It's just Oh boy. <laughs> Love the Rudolph tree. And there's a train and there's Santa himself. Don't worry, Santa, you don't have to tell me how bad I've been this year. I already know. <laughs> Look at the, there's Rudolph hiding back there. Look at that. <laughs> wow. This is so cool. Here's what I call the Mountain Dew tree. Even though it's the elf tree because of the green lights and the frost, it just kind of reminds me of Mountain Dew. I have no idea why. Maybe I'm just that fat? I don't know. Anyway, moving on over here. Look at the look at the sparkly trees we got. My gosh. I just hope I don't get a copyright claim because of the music. Look at that. I love the snowflake lights on that tree. I'm sure that thing costs a pretty penny. But anyway, wow. You guys have to see it to believe it. This is incredible. This is wild. Like I said, don't mind me talking so much. I have no choice. I, I don't want to get, wow, just, just wow. Wow, look at this. That is cool. I wonder how much that costs. You know, I love lights. That would be wicked cool. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I really like that. If I did the front of my place with that, oh my God, you'll see me from outer space. <laughs> Look at this tree. It's like, whoop. It's so heavy on top, it's leaning over. <laughs> Look at this tree here. Wow. Look at the size of the poncettas. Wow, the wreath with the ornaments hanging off of it. That is incredible. Now here we are for the real reason for the season. This is this is really nice. This is the one that kind of gets me every time. <laughs> this is amazing. Amazing. Wow. <laughs> I wish I didn't have to talk so you can enjoy the music, but I'm afraid of it coming back to 
get me, you know? Wow. Oh, holy night. This was, there it is, there's the manger scene. Wow. And obviously, if you want to read the scripts, you can pause the video, go back and pause the video. But wow, that was really incredible. Well done, guys. If you people at Crane Axe are seeing this video, that was spectacular. I think that's the best one I've seen yet, and I've been doing this for years now. So awesome, awesome job. Really, really love that a lot. And I see a couple of items I want to buy thanks to that. So thank you. Oh, look, we got a train up here. Oh, it's just it just stopped. <laughs> anyway oh wow they got new shirts in this year check this out they got sweatshirts a family tradition crane axe well these are long sleeve t-shirts i don't really do long sleeve i wear short sleeve but i could make amends i've seen that one before now but these ones are new look at that one too these are fun these are fun shirts i like these a lot maybe these are maybe these are short sleeve no, they're long sleeve as well. No big deal. We can make that work. And there's the sweatshirts here. Yep. I was so focused on the shirts that I totally missed this. Santa Claus is coming to Crane Axe in Hermitage, PA. And he should be here. Oh, I remember buying these a couple of years ago. You got to get the little metal balls into the little uh, slots around a thing if they would stop spinning like they're in a NASCAR race. Oh, I almost had one. Let's see if I can get at least one. I bought one because there we got one. Yeah, almost had two. Ooh. I, anyway, I won't bore you with that. <laughs> Look, Navy got Cranex lip balm as well. I never seen this too. The little plaque, Cran Cranex Santa's Christmas Land. Oh, you can just put it up like a stand. I like that. It's only ten dollars. I love Pennsylvania, dear Santa. Don't forget to stop in Cleveland, Ohio. Why? <laughs> Dear Santa, don't forget to stop and share in PA. That's a little better. <laughs> no hate, Cleveland. I love that city. They have other t-shirts as well in all different colors here. And these are short sleeve shirts too. But I love this one here. I wish they had that in a short sleeve. I mean, I could buy and just cut the sleeves off, but that's cool. They even have Cranex mugs. That's awesome. Oh, and look at this little fella right here. The little reindeer snow globe. <laughs> now this is what I like to see. Look at all the Christmas trees they have in here. Look at all the nutcrackers they have in here too. And they got lots of lights and this isn't even, this is just the tip of the iceberg with lights. They have some here, they have some inflatables like the Grinch, Peanuts. Here's that curtain of lights like I had seen in the Christmas Wonderland. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of money. But you see how much they do. Oh, there's, there's a bigger package. And you can troll them by your phone. Yeah, if I wasn't going to see my one of my favorite bands in the world this weekend and the following week, Catatonia in Baltimore, Cleveland, and in Pittsburgh, I would consider that. <laughs> But I gotta save my money, so. Hi, Mr. Penguin. Look at you. Look how classy you look with that bow. I love it. Sharp. <laughs> Hi, Santa. Hi, Mrs. Sa Mrs. Claus. I almost called you Mrs. Santa. What's up, bud? It's a little warm in here. How the heck are you hanging on? No joke. It is really warm in here. It's also pretty warm outside for November, so. Um, just how it is. But that's snowman. All of them. I'd be worried if I were them. <laughs> they just have so many little trees here, too. This would have been perfect for Halloween. This would have been great for my uh, ornaments, which I never did find. It's only $13.59 for that, too. I ought to buy that for next year, then. That's great. That's what I needed. There's one that looks like it's in... I kind of like how that one is a little bit more. I know you can just fluff this up a little bit, but... I'll have to consider that. I'm going to do some shopping once the video's over. But anyway, look at all the trees. Lighted tree elves. Look at that. I didn't even notice the Christmas wind chimes. Look at that. They have Santa. We saw the snowman. They have the bells. That's cool. 
Kate, I know you like Cardinals. You clearly know I do. Anyway, wow, the purple tree is cool. Look at this ribbon light. I've never seen anything like that. It's soft, too. Very flexible. I've never seen anything like that. It's very warm, by the way, too. Yeah, that's quite warm. I would make sure that that's in a safe place. It's not, like, it doesn't burn your hand, but it's warm, very warm to the touch. So, love that tree there. We got a lot of people here, too, which I'm kind of surprised for this early in the season. But then again, this place is pretty awesome. So why wouldn't you want to come out here? And the people here are great people. There's another one of those uh, trees here. I would get for Halloween. $13.59 for that. That's not too bad, honestly. Look at that big metal sign. It says Merry Christmas. Yeah, the trees that they have are awesome. They even have this display here with the little trees. Look at this one. They have a kitty one, a puppy one. I love the ornament that says meow. One that says wolf. Wolf, not wolf. And then they have the snow globes on display in here. Look at that one. It's like a little tornado in a tree. <laughs> yeah, very, very cool. Look at that one with the cardinals. I love that one. Love these little trees that they have too. Look at the cat. <laughs> Very awesome. Over here, since we are close to Pittsburgh and we're not all that far from Cleveland, I mean, we're closer to Pittsburgh than Cleveland, I imagine, they got a tree for both teams. And I can't believe it, the Steelers won a game. I, I can't, I mean, I don't know how we keep winning anyway. This terrible towel is cool. I've never seen this one. That must be brand new. Here we go. Offense. It should say defense somewhere. Touchdown. Yeah, there it goes. Defense. I love that. They have the dog leashes, a mouse pad, and then the Browns. And they're playing today. They got receiver gloves, really? Youth receiver gloves. <laughs> That's funny. Then we have other team sports, too, like Penn State. Ohio State. I know my boss will just loves Ohio State. I just take a picture and send it to him. Look at that. Actually, you know, I, I you know I rip on the Browns, but I'm actually a fan as well. Not, I mean, I'm a diehard black and gold Steelers and Pens fan. But you know, they used to do so bad. I actually felt bad for them, and it kind of turned me into a fan inadvertently. I dig it. I mean, I'm a Bills fan too, but I'm Steelers fan first of all, though. But very cool. And I mean, look at these, the Steeler trees. How can you go wrong with those? Look at that, two Santa. We'll go up that way in just a moment, but I want to show you these trees first because they have more over here. Look at the black bear. For a minute, on the corner of my eye, I thought it was a dog. <laughs> There's another one over there. Hi, friends. How are you guys doing today? Wow, look at these lights. Love the soft glow of these lights on this tree really like that a lot and well they have got people over there look at the little palm tree i love that that would be awesome for the summertime how much is that thing 50 bucks and considering the one i'd seen at boscov's was like 169 dollars for one that was like six feet tall or seven feet tall that's not too bad i mean if you really want to i'm sure you can make your own get the branches and necessities you need get a string of lights build your own but to have it pre-made already that's pretty cool and there's one here in a box anyway that's the trees there and there's more over there as a matter of fact let's try and get over there can't go that way we have to go this way and we'll do just that and then we'll go back there we're going to be going all over this is going to be a long video like it normally is okay here we go up the ramp we got more trees here look at the big archway here that's about nine, ten feet tall, just about. There's Santa right there with a present in his hand. There's the list, which I know I'm not going to be on. Look at the size of this nutcracker. It's about five feet tall. Look at these. Look at the motion musical angels. Fiber optic angels. That's very cool. Fiber optic trees and snowmen. Or gingerbread man, I'm sorry. There's Peanuts Christmas tree. I have mine from years past. 
There it is right there. Oh, the reindeer and Santa aren't lit on that display. But that wreath is. That wreath is huge. It's about the size of a truck tire inner tube. <laughs> wow. Oh, if I had a yard for that. Kate, we get a house where we got to come back and get one of those. <laughs> um, anyway, got more fiber optic trees here. These are the really tall ones. I love that one with the blue. I just love that color blue on it. Wow, look at the, we got more rows of trees here. Let's go take a look through them all. There's a Christmas train. Hi, St. Nick. There's a polar bear. <laughs> wow. Yeah, lots of trees. This has always been one of the best places for Christmas trees with the amount that they have. Menards is really good too. I've discovered in recent years now too. Look at that, Santa sleigh. <laughs> Oh, isn't that just beautiful? Look at that one there. The Coca-Cola machine. Just lit up with all the bright colors of different sodas. Yeah, I actually did that. I can't believe I did that, but I did. Hope you got a good laugh. Let's move on. They got the big bows. Snowman. Santa. We got another penguin. Another Santa. We got more trees down this way here. Look, look at the clump of uh, palm trees. Look, there's a large one there, $127. The group of them in that pot. I love it. They have a black bear here. These ones won't hurt you either, thankfully. Go for a ride on that one until I break it. <laughs> anyway, the drummer boy. That's me. It's just missing the long hair. <laughs> anyway, now we'll continue on down into here. They got a lot of toys and stocking stuffers in here, too. And I know Santa's around somewhere. He's probably back there. Yeah, he's back there. Now, I don't really want to get too much of a shot of them because there are children in there. And, you know, people like their privacy. I know you can't really avoid it at a place like this, but I try to respect that. There's the head honcho himself, Santa. <laughs> Look at all the Christmas plates. They have so many. And look at all the St. Nick's and Mrs. Claus up here. Here's a here's another. Yep, see, look, my name didn't make the list. <laughs> Figures. <laughs> What's this? Well, she got one, too. I didn't make that one, either. Okay. Figures. Look at the Christmas tray here. Merry Christmas. It's nice and heavy. Oh, I was holding two of them. They're still pretty heavy, though. Uh, placemats. Oh, look at these placemats. I love that. I love that. They, they're very slippery, though. I feel like if I had it on a table, I'd be skating across the whole thing. <laughs> um, I know I'm not going to be able to film everything in here because there's just so much. But I'm trying to just run along and talk as we do this because they have that much. And it's amazing. And I have to keep talking as well because of the overhead music playing. I don't want to copyright claim. Now, here's some awesome wall art. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Not like I need any more wall art, but I keep doing it anyway. Love this. I feel like these are from Dollar Tree. Like, they're the same material quality, but they're $4 here. But you're supporting a family-run business. You're not supporting a big corporate chain like Family Dollar, so... I can understand that a little bit. Now, I want to see all that, but we got people in the way there, so we can't do that. Home for the Holidays with the Cardinal. Love that. Oh, Holy Night. They have Christmas activity books, scratch art. What are these? Make your own holiday snow globes. That's cool. Is that Evil Knievel? Yeah. <laughs> Sweater ornaments. Not too much Christmassy things here, except for some of the signs that they have placed along the wall here. And I mean, you see the other wall art and it's just like the railroad crossing sign. Look at the old Fanta one. But yep, they have a bunch. Oh, and then they have these little books here, personalized with everybody's names on them, except you'll never see my name on any of these. There's Nathan right there. <laughs> you'll never see my name though. There's Leah for my cat. <laughs> now we just need one for Larry. 
that's really nice. I love the blue on that. Peace on Earth. That's just a calming feeling when you see something, when I see something like that anyway. Peace on Earth. With everything going on in the world these days, I think we could all use a little peace. They got the headbands again. <laughs> oh my gosh. I remember, oop, I'm knocking it down. I remember a few years ago when I had one on with Nate and I said, yeah, look, that chick behind you, or that dude behind you is wearing your sweater. And he looks around and says, I think it's a chick. And I went, oops. <laughs> oh, look at this. Let's get lit. Naughty? Nice. I tried. Yeah, I did. Slay all day. Oh, awesome. Here's the countdown to Christmas. Wall art. Santa's beard in that one. Holiday popper. They have a reindeer. They have a nutcracker. There's Santa. <laughs> then they have stickers, too. What? Scratch and stiff stinky stickers? Peppy mints? What? I don't get... Your tops. Oh, that's cool. Here we have all the elf on a shelf items. The Santa hats. Little activity book. I, I don't even know. Sand, stand and scoot cruise into Christmas. Okay, they even have the uh, elf story. Night before Christmas. Didn't know they had this many things for elf on a shelf. They even have the Grinch operation. What's this? National Lampoons. Christmas Vacation Monopoly. They have Christmas Opoly too. Awesome. And then they have Elf Monopoly. Where's the Christmas Story one now, huh? Where is it and why doesn't it exist? I'm sure somewhere it does, but I don't see it. Anyway, look at all the neckties. The tacky, Christmassy neckties. I love it. They got, look at the little the little winter caps too, and the scarves. Try me. Well, I'm trying, yeah. Oh, that one's blinking. I can't. Oh, there we go. Well, at least we got to see what it's like. Look at the the hats with the long sides. I don't. I don't get. I mean, I guess you can put your hands in there, keep them warm. I don't. I don't know. The thick socks. Snowman hat. More socks. Who gives a split? I love that for bowling. <laughs> I hate when I hit the ball right in the pocket because I bowl a lot. Hit the ball right in the pocket, pocket 7-10 or pocket something dumb like maybe a, like a 10-4 or like a 7-6 or whatever. It, I just don't understand how it happens, but it does. Anyway, Dr. Seuss is the Grinch. All the Grinch items. They even have the Grinch clue. That's cool. Okay, I've never seen this wall art before. That is awesome. It's $30. It's heavy duty, too. It's not like it's real thin. It's, it's like an actual piece of wood. Even if it's just ply, ply board or ply wood or whatever. Look, they have gingerbread house kits. But these aren't ones you eat. They're ones that you paint and decorate. Very cool. Nativity scene as well. And then we have all the stuffed animals here. We have reindeers. Elves. Uh, marshmallows. We have a llama. Is that a big, like, s'more? Or what? what is that? Yeah, it's like s'mores, I guess. I don't remember a marshmallow being yellow, though. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Fun. Hi, Mr. S Penguin. I almost called you a snowman. I got so many things going on, it's easy for me to mix up what I'm saying, because <sighs> between meeting all the fans, and you know, it's just so much fun meeting the fans that I've been running into today. Um, I'm just so thankful for it, but I got a lot of things going on. So every time I try to talk, I'm thinking of something else as I'm looking at something else. And it's easy for me to mix it all up. So bear with me. I hope you're enjoying. This is a lot of fun. 
Anyway, let's go look at some lights. Hand-tied velvet bows. They have a bunch. And here we go with some lights. I love coming into this room here. More bows. More lights. I love the wreath. The fiber optic wreath. But look at the lights. Oh my gosh. I love the candle. I've never seen the candle before. At least not that I'm aware of. Keep in mind when I do Christmas videos, I do a bunch of them. So it's easy for me to forget sometimes. But yeah, they have a lot of lights. They have a lot of wreaths in here. Very nice. Look at the blue penguin. That's cool. I so badly want to buy more things. It's just so easy to dump money here. <laughs> but it is early in the season. I, like I said, I got those Catatonia shows I saved up and worked hard for. And, uh, well, I also have my future to look forward to as well. Um, for those that don't know, Kate, Kate will be coming to the States. And uh, let's just say the future looks very, very exciting for us. There are those trees again. The bells, too. And we have wreaths over here that light up. We have a few. And right around this corner, we have a lot more lights. Holy smokes, look at the size of that Merry Christmas sign. It's huge. It's like four and a half, five feet long. I like that one, though. The LED board, or the LED lights, though. It is a board, $229. I don't like it that much. No, I'm just kidding. It is very nice, though. Even that one is cool. Um, what else? The bells. Like these, the mirror with the lights in the sides of them. That's very cool. I've never seen anything like that before. Santa's talking. <laughs> the reindeer flying. Yeah, but those mirror finish. Like the tree and the sleigh and the deer. That's cool. Tree, Santa stop here. A big chunky snowman nativity scene. They have the campers, the candles, candy canes. I don't know what it is, but there is just something about this little cat decked out for Christmas. I just love that to death. And it's $8.99. That is adorable. They have pet-related, dog and cat-related Christmas goodies here, too. Besides little flags, they have mats, ornaments that you can personalize. They have blank spaces on them, so you can organize or, you know, personalize them. Can't talk. I told you, it's a problem. They have stockings with kitties on them. There's one with a dog, a couple of them. There's more, one with a cat. <laughs> Look at the little cat pillows. Oh, my God. It looks like... My belated cat, Momo, with the little soul patch he had on his chin. Wow, that's hitting me in the feels pretty hard right now. I have more dog stockings over here. And I like the little cat stocking stuffer stocking thing. I like that. And, you know, guys, uh, it's just this, looking like my belated cat, Momo. Here's a picture of him for reference. Um... I know this is $10, but I need this. It hurts. He was taken too soon. Um, you know, 11 years was not long enough. But sometimes things happen. Like, he got osteosarcoma in his leg, and that was pretty much it, even after amputating it and saving him. Got another year, but that was it, unfortunately. If we can get back on a good note, that would be nice. I'd love to do that with all the pet ornaments that they have here. These are adorable. They have a bunch, too. Yep, more ornaments. You can personalize all of them as well. That's cool. Anyway, now let's go into here where we have ornaments, ribbon, decorations, tinsel garland big letters that spell out Noel. Cardinals. Remember, I bought a cardinal here last year. It was bigger than that, though. I know that. But it's nice that they have little ones, too, now. But yeah, they have lots of ribbons, so you can make crafts like that, like that wreath. And I'm sure it'll be in this section that I'll find that snowy owl that I want to get for my tree. I'm not sure where it'll be, but we will find it. Look at all the tree skirts that they have here. Wow that one and 
Nate sweater. Nate sweater. Nate sweater. Again. <laughs> It'll never get old, guys. I'm sorry. Again, this is one of those situations where I just can't show you everything because we'll be here all day long. We haven't even gotten to the ornaments yet. They're, they're beyond this room here. These are just figurines that they have. Some arts and crafts. A lot of tinsel garland in colors I've never seen anywhere but here. Five ninety nine for fifteen feet. Not that bad, actually, considering. But yeah, they always they've always had such a vast selection of tinsel garland. Love it. Look at that candle there. That candle's awesome too. Merry Christmas. I love it. They have nat nativity scene figures. Christmas tree toppers with the angels. Look at that nativity scene there. Wow. That's really detailed too. They have a bunch. Oh, look at all the stockings up here too. We have a bunch of stockings. Oh my gosh. We'll look at those in a second. But the stockings. Like I said, everyone, it's just impossible to show you everything. But there is one thing I'm going to show you because I know Kate loves it. And I love it too. It's the aisle with the Cardinals. I love it. Look at that one there. <laughs> they have a bunch. They have a bunch. I love it. And then we're getting into birds. I did see some owls. Some, one of the other... Isles, I guess. Owls and Isles. <laughs> yeah, that little one on the uh, tree stump. Lots of snowmen in this aisle. Got polar bears over here. And penguins. <laughs> Where did I see the owls? Oh, here they were. Here, here are the owls. Look at that. Yeah, but the owls, and they have reindeer, and bears, <laughs> and a raccoon. Look at that, it's a bear, a raccoon, and a squirrel. <laughs> you could have your own Santa belly. I don't need that, I already got that. Elf set. Couples, uh, I guess, costumes. Oh my god. Well, I guess it's just one, and you have to get each one separately, which would make sense, but that's hilarious. That, that though, my gosh. <laughs> Here we go into ornaments. This is, this. I'll put it this way. If you want to see all of them and look at them all for yourself, you need to just come here. It's just impossible to show you all of them because it's just aisle after aisle of ornaments and they have little signs here too these aren't necessarily ornaments they're just little signs tis the season look at that welcome friends happy holidays with the cardinal i love the cardinals you know i've always loved that every every year when i do these holiday videos a lot of ornaments everywhere you look Oh, we found owls again. We gotta be getting close to that one we saw in the tree. That just clips on. I imagine they'll be in a bin like like these items are. Look at the snowman heads. <laughs> I imagine they'll be in little bins like that. Excuse me. Look at the little cardinal ornament there. Just, there's a lot of people in here too. It's not as bad as it could have been and like it's been in the past where it was just crazy, crazy busy. It's busy enough though. I will say that. Look at that one. Deck the halls. Little tin ornament. And this one says special delivery. Merry Christmas. That's cute. And look at this one made out of candy. The garland made out of candy and gumdrops and that kind of thing. Peppermints. 
more ornaments. These are all breakable ones, too. These are the ones that shatter when they hit the floor. Wow, look at the peacock. Oh, we're getting close. We're getting into birds now. We gotta be getting near the owls. I want that snowy owl. There's a little one there. It's not what I'm looking for, though. Can't mistake that thing. If they had it on a tree in the Christmas land, I will guarantee you they have them here. Unless they're sold out. That, that's a possibility. And I'm sure if I asked, they might work with me. I don't know, but... I don't want to take it off of their display that they worked so hard to do. I don't want to even ask. If it's meant to be, it'll be around here somewhere. <laughs> Look at the uh, cardinal tree topper. Lots more ornaments. I just can't show them all. So, Look at the white bright one. Look at that one. The Operation Twister Battleship. Life, Candyland, trains, John Deere tractors. Oh, they have little owls there, but those still aren't the ones. It was bigger than that. Got birds. Still not it, though. Here's deer. Oh, here we go. We're, we're owls again. We're getting close. Not quite like that. But we're getting close. Is that a sloth? Oh my god, it is. <laughs> like I said, you just have to come here and check it out for yourself if you want to see everything because there's just that much here. More cardinals. The cardinal's a little candle holder. Look at that one by the lamp. Oh, look at that one there. Hmm. This is awesome. They still got some fall and Halloween stuff up too. 25% off. Oh, look at the polar bears and the penguins. They're the Christmas tree toppers, the angels. And we're getting into lights. I haven't been able to find that owl, but I'm not done looking because this place is so large it could be anywhere if they have them available. They could be sold out. And here I was thinking that they would absolutely have it. I've never seen so many Christmas flags in one place in my life. <laughs> oh my gosh, they got so many. And there were more behind me, too. Yeah, here are the large ones here. And they got all different patterns. Tis the season. Oh, look at that one. Now we're into more lights. And they have always had a pretty awesome selection of lights available here. And where was it? Oh, yeah. We looked at the tree toppers on the other side. Now they have the stars on this side here. And they have various designs of stars. Quite the selection. I know Kate likes that song. That was Mariah Carey there. She's officially defrosted and is back. Oh, look at these. I remember these from Ogle Bay. The flowers. I've always thought these were cool. And they always... Put them up all over Ogle Bay, which will be there later this week for Light Up Night on Thursday. So if you're watching this video prior to November 9th, come down to Ogle Bay. I'll be there after work for Light Up Night and to do my annual drive through video of the park, Cardinal Lights. I'll be there to do that. If you see me, say hi. Keep in mind, I'll be filming. So let me film and then come say hi to me and we'll have some fun. And they got the poinsettia lights. I, I ended up buying a pack of these at, what was it, Boscov's last year. And I loved them very much. I got them after Christmas, but I liked them. I even kept them up all year long in the window. I didn't care. <laughs> they have elf lights. They have the Christmas story leg lamp lights. They have avocado lights. 
despicable me. Look, they got pizza lights. <laughs> got Charlie Brown, too. That's cool. Look how many. Look, Rudolph. What are these ones here? Gnomes. And up here they have owl lights. Oh, is that cool? The owls? Very cool. I wonder where they have the lanterns. Remember I pointed those out in the Christmas Wonderland or Christmas Land? I'd be curious to find those. I love those. I would get those in a heartbeat if I find them. Well, there's more lights on the other side, so why don't we take a look over there and see if we find them. Look, they got tractors. Ooh, look at the stars. They almost kind of look like the Langoliers. <laughs> oh boy, they got they got deer. They have cows, soccer balls, snowmen. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they have a bunch. They have fish. Yeah, they have the bass here. Or trout. Trout, yes. And oh look. I think we're getting close. They have the little candles here. But I'm looking for the lanterns. They have beer mugs. All right. Let's see. Santa. More snowmen. More owls. Nightmare Before Christmas. Ball ballet shoes. And two t uh, pineapples. Uh, seashells. Okay, that's different. It's cool. It's a cool different. I've never seen seashell lights before. I'd keep those up year-round. Especially since I like summer and I love the beach. There are the frosted lights that I was pointing out on one of the Christmas trees. They have the frosted ones that I really, really like. And then they have the clear ones as well. And they have donuts too. Anybody see those lantern? Oh, here they are. Are these it? No, I don't think these are it. Flicker flame. No, not it. I can honestly say I've never seen space string lights. Oh, is that cool? That's really cool. Twenty dollars for that. Look at the Holly Berry cluster light set too. I like those just as much. Um, so we're finding these little candle lights, but I'm not finding the lantern lights that I liked that were on one of the trees. Now they have these, but these aren't exactly what I was looking at. They were different. Boy, I just really seem to be striking out today. I don't know what it is, but I can't find those lights. I can't find that owl. I'm sure there will be something here that'll stand out and I'll be able to get that. And like like the, the little Moo Moo pillow that I'm getting, I'm getting this for my mom because my mom misses him a ton. So uh, yeah, starting a Christmas shop already. <laughs> but anyway, and I've already started before Halloween. But anyway, side note. It's, it's really fun to meet fans when I'm here doing this, but I just ran into another guy that actually runs a YouTube channel, too. And, you know, he doesn't know this, but go check out Every Day. Adventures with Jim. He was a really nice guy, and I'm sure he'll appreciate it because he was just talking about watching one of my older videos from here. And, uh, yeah, it, like I said, it's just really fun to meet fans. So go check out his channel, subscribe to him, tell him I sent you. So nice little surprise there. Anyway... Let's keep looking for these lights. We have a lot of lights to get through still, so maybe I just didn't get to them yet. The snowman, those stars are wild looking. Look at that cardinal, those cardinals are huge. It's really awesome. Oh, here are all the night lights. I always like to point out these night lights because they just have so many different designs and they're all really cool. Look at this one here. See, that's I love that. And I'd like to have those lights to put on my Christmas tree. Those lantern ones, but I guess that's just not meant to be, huh? Look at that one, the little bubble light with the cardinal on it. See any you like? looking through more aisles of lights. I still can't find the ones I'm looking for. But if you're looking for something in particular, they have quite a lot. And here's those neon flex rope lights. 20 light, 28 lights per foot. 
$34.99. It's 13 feet long. Wow. That's pretty serious stuff. Well, I did finally luck out on something. I'd been looking for starry night, twinkling warm white lights for so long. And even though the brand that I was looking for didn't have them, they have this brand. And it's exactly what I've been wanting to look for for a while. Now, my aunt got these a few years ago. And she said one of her friends had them as well in like bushes and hedges outside of her house. And at nighttime, it almost looks like fireflies yeah, in the hedges. The it's pretty cool. Now, check out all of the awesome village buildings here. All the detail that goes into all of these, too. They just have so many. And they're all in boxes up above and below these displays. Very cool. Excuse me. No, they got so many. Look at the pizza one. Wow. Here we have the amusement park displays. That is cool. Lost Rafters, aka the Tilt Whirl. Crazy cars. This is so cool. They got the good old roundup. Fun times. This is so cool. Now we're at the snow globes and the glass of the porcelain trees. <laughs> but yeah, they have a lot of snow globes and we're just getting started. All those stars. Wow. Look at the one with the cardinal. Or the, no, those are gnomes. I thought they were cardinals at first because I saw the red gingerbread houses. I'll zoom out a little bit. There you go. Yeah, look at them all. And they got more down here too. Snow globes. And then gingerbread houses. They have National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, Department 56 items, Snow Village. They even have Christmas Story over here in the corner. I'll show you that in a second, but there's more Christmas Vacation. There you go, there's a Christmas Story. There's the infamous house. And they have other buildings as well. Schwartz's house. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this one, the last straw. When Ralphie's beating the heck out of Scott Farkas. I love that. The O fudge scene, the unpacking of the light, the leg lamp. Oh, uh, you know, I have mine. I was so happy to finally get that thing a couple of years ago. I even have the Grinch. They have all kinds of different village sets and houses and buildings. Then over here we have more snow globes and these ones have cardinals. Lots and lots of cardinals. Look at this one in the lamp post. Lots of cardinals. Kate, I'm so glad you like cardinals like I do. <laughs> I think we're gonna start wrapping up this video here soon, but they got candles here. These are LED candles, so you don't have to worry about a fire. And they have a bunch with the cardinals on them too, which I just love. I love that with the cardinals. <laughs> Water globes. Little fireplace. There's more here. They, they have quite a lot, I will say. And it's just difficult to show everything because of how much they have and because it's really busy in here all of a sudden. 
it got more and more and more busy as the day went on. So I went back through Santa's Christmas land and I looked at that snowy owl that I saw in one of the trees there. And it's actually this one, but the thing is this one, the face is facing the other way, whereas on the one on the display, it's facing this way. So I looked at it and all the details, that's it. It's only $12.99, so I want to get it to put in my tree. I think it would look really good. So this little buddy of mine's coming home. So at least I got that and those lights and the little pillow that looks like Momo. So I think that'll be a wrap for here. Before I head out, I figured I'd show you the candy canes. Twinkies candy canes. Kool-Aid candy canes. Girl Scout Thin Mints candy canes. Dum Dums, Mint M&M's, 7-Up, A&W, and Dr. Pepper. Hot Tamale, Hershey's, Jolly Rancher. Your traditional ones. Starburst. What are these? Oh, popcorn balls. They got these here, too. Awesome. There's that fun book. I still have to do that for a video. Holiday Adventure, the Oreo, Skittles. They got all kinds of candy, too. I wish I would have known about those before I paid for all my stuff. I don't feel like getting back in line. <laughs> yeah, they got all kinds of holiday candy. And they have more over here as well. Chocolate-covered cherries. Christmas Story fudge. Gingerbread houses. Lots of candy. Advent calendars, too, or holiday countdown. Holy cow. Other snack size. I was going to say, if that was one big chocolate bar. <laughs> oh, yeah, that would be coming home with me. <laughs> but that's not the case but yeah they got a lot of candy here and they actually have a lot more food in here too i'm just not showing you all because I'm, i've already been here oh my god the yardstick of kit kats 18 full-size packs oh <laughs> that's awesome hey if anybody wants to get me a christmas gift um yeah this would be cool as heck all right anyway I'm not kidding. If somebody wants to get me that, I would love you forever. Anyway, because uh, that's my favorite candy. So, anyway, I am going to sign off Santa Pez dispensers. They got the snowman as well. And, uh, I, like I said, I know I'm missing things, but I'm going to sign off because this video is long and I'm exhausted. <laughs> but, yeah, somebody hooked me up. I love you forever. Appreciate it. All right. Well, that wraps up another adventure here at Cranax after the Catatonia shows and uh, probably closer to Thanksgiving, I'll be back here to do some holiday shopping. Anyway, I did get that little cat pillow, though, the uh, one that looks like Moom, and I got that from my mom. Anyway, and I uh, got the yowl and the lights. Probably shouldn't have spent that much money, but hey, you know what? I'll work a little overtime to make that back up. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give the video a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe to the channel so you can be alerted for content. And I'll see you next time, everybody. Take care and stay awesome. Thanks for watching. Bye.